Hello, everyone. Daniel here from the Next Issue Podcast. On today's video, I'll be doing a review of Hell to Pay number one from Image Comics. Uh, I have been looking forward to this book because of the creative team behind it. So let's talk about the creators, first of all. Uh, so this book is written by Charles Soule with art by Will Sliney, um, Rachel Rosenberg on colors, and Chris Crank on letters. Uh, really cool cover by Dave Johnson, who is a, a cover artist extraordinaire. So this book, uh, like I said, I'm a big fan of Charles Soule. Uh, I'm not as familiar with Will's work, but uh, after looking at what's going on in this book, I'm definitely on board. Uh, so in this book, uh, the Shrouded College will give you magic, but you will incur debt. Until it's paid, you belong to them. Married couple Maya and Sebastian Stone took that deal. They've worked for the college ever since, using their new abilities to track down 666 cursed coins. Uh, aka the devil's dollar, they're called uh Kurak, uh, I think, and that's how I would say it. Uh, so only a few remain, the stones are almost free, but the devil's in the details. Uh, this book is described as Hellboy meets Indiana Jones and in a supernatural adventure. Uh, and as you guys know, uh, Charles Soul from A Bill and Ginny's Undiscovered Country, Star Wars, many, many other things. Uh, Will Sliney from Spider Man books at Marvel. So very excited to check this out, and I, I really, really enjoyed uh, this. Uh, I guess I will get my one caveat out of the way. I really feel because of the way this book is set up that I will enjoy it more as a collection. Uh, I think unlike 8 Billion Genies, which feels very episodic, uh, this one could this one could also feel that way, I think. I, think I, I, I don't know if it was just this first issue that felt like there was a whole overarching story more. But we could definitely focus on each uh, each issue, you know, uh, tracking down a few of these uh, these coins that are left. So, uh, but you guys, let me know what you think about that in the comments. Uh, so let's move on to looking at some preview art because I think Sly really delivers here, uh, specifically in like just the design of all these, uh, like like these these unexplored uh, areas of this house. Uh, as this individual kind of falls into the trap. Uh, I really love, first of all, I love a heist. I love a good heist. Uh, and that's what Maya and Sebastian are all about, right? This mission, it's almost like they're super spies for the supernatural, which feels really cool. Uh, but then we get to another layer of, of really just really fun stuff. When we talk about all the supernatural stuff, we actually go to hell. And we see it and we see what's going on. I think it's really interesting that this coin is created. It almost feels a little bit like the uh, like a commentary on some of the, the, the digital currency. I won't get too much into that because I'm not familiar with that. Uh, that was just a feeling I got, I got when I was reading it. Um, but it's really interesting. And then, yeah, everything that happens in hell, like it is gruesome. It is like Sliney and Rosenberg, specifically with the coloring, like they go all out to make sure that you know that this is a different place uh, than where Maya and Sebastian are. Uh, so really, really fun stuff. Uh, I quite enjoyed this issue. Like I said, I think this will read for me better collected, but I'll check out the second issue uh, just to confirm that that is the case. But you guys let me know, what did you think of this book? Uh, and or if you read, you know, if you were to check it out. Uh, like I said, I think the creative team behind it, it's really talented. So very much looking forward to see where this goes. I like the characters. I like Maya and Sebastian. I think they are somebody I can get behind. Um, and I want to know more about this Shrouded College. Uh, what else What else is happening? There, there, there's got to be other cursed objects that they're looking for, right? I'm a big fan of Supernatural stuff. Specifically, this to me feels a little bit like Jujutsu Kaisen, same, like, very similar in the premise, obviously very different material, but, uh, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. Um, and as always, thank you for watching everyone. Remember to share, like subscribe, hit the bell. So you know, when we go live, that is most Saturdays, 10 a.m. Central Standard time, stay tuned. Cause we have more comic, uh, comic reviews, trailer reactions, TV recaps, movie reviews, all that fun stuff in the channel. And as always, thanks for watching everyone. Bye. -bye.